Hi everyone and welcome back to Artifar C. New product today from Tech One Hobby. This is the number two in a series of four. Uh, you have seen the MSX. This is the Yacht 55, and we will get the S Pack and the SU29, which all comes with the same uh, preferences. The fuselage and wingspan. The wingspan is 800 millimeter. The fuselage is 840. You can choose whatever motor you want to have to this one in for indoor flying, of course. Um, on the box it says what kind of motor they are uh, recommending, and here it is: uh, 2004 KV 1700 and uh, and 10 amp ESC, of course, and six to eight grams micro servos. I just uh, finished building this one as I promised I will do a short time-lapse video on this one it took me about 40 minutes to build this I'm getting real good at this now so I'm going to show you guys the time-lapse and then we're heading uh, into the gym to do some test flying and also with some other planes that we have for testing so Yak 55 number two in the serial four you have seen the MSX this is the Yak 55, so stay tuned for the S Pack and the SU 29. See you guys later, bye! Jumped in the jack for the heart of Central. Through the gears, but the traffic's mental. Is this the bit where we say goodbye? Trying to twist my system I gotta think how to fix your problem I hate to see my baby cry Lift my face up to the sky Another model from uh, Tech One Hobby. It's from the series of four planes that I was talking about. This is the Yak 55 EPP, and uh, we just did a test run with it. And I want to show you now how good it really flies. Uh, very playful plane. You can do whatever you want to do with it. Uh, I'm wondering about putting a VPP system on this one, but I'm not sure yet. Anyway, this is the Yak. 55.
<laughs> okay, Yak 55 from Tech One Hobby. Beautiful plane, easy to fly uh, with the right setup, expo and so on. But uh, really, really beautiful. I can't wait to get my hands on the S pack and the SU 29, and I will of course make videos of them. So thank you for watching. Bye.